could. Hi, my name's Janice Connolly. Uh, my name's Michael Crouch. And um, we've got together to create this piece of work that we call Stuff. Uh, we've been very, very lucky because we've been working with Cloud's End. I've been, I talked to some people who have got hoarding issues and we wanted to try and find a way of putting a spotlight onto this deeply human behaviour, really, of hoarding. There's no time at the present. I will start with this tub of paintbrushes. Here we go. What I'm going to get rid of will go in there. It's a deal. Okay. okay. And we thought it would be brilliant to look at working as a solo performer with another solo performer, in this case a puppeteer. I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, I was very attracted to the idea of um, the companionship of objects as a puppeteer. That's quite familiar territory. Uh, and also the tyranny of stuff, how the things that we own can end up owning us. I don't have to throw this away, do I? But I said I wanted to make a change, didn't I? As a hoarder, we need to get past the stigma. So I think a piece of theatre like this does a number of things. It shows somebody at the centre of a condition, because at the centre of any hoarding is one person. It opens it up to people so that they get a little bit of an understanding about what hoarding is, that actually it's not about being dirty or just hanging on to stuff that's meaningless. Everything has meaning to us, and it's that understanding um, around what that meaning is, is the core to helping people then deal with what's appropriate to hang on to and what's starting to become destructive. It's, it's using humour that makes people understand what Sarah's been talking about and I think it's a different approach which lots of people can, can see without having to pick up an article and read it, if you know what I mean. I think it's there and it's easy to, to use. I think we need to take as many approaches as we possibly can to explore compassion. I come in here and I look at all my stuff and they go, did she live like this? Hoarding is not about stuff and objects. And there is a person that needs to be dealt with compassionately. And I think theatre is a great way to get inside people. I think... Theatre has always been there to tell a story um, and this is a story that needs telling and these guys tell it well.